Hey everybody, it's Jeff Gaffney from Better Homes and Gardens Real Estate 3 and this weekend on Charlottesville Insights we've got a great program for you. We have Greg Slater. He's going to be talking about what's happening in the real estate market. What happened in April? We're going to break it down. We have Mike Buczynski is going to be with us on the show this weekend from New American Mortgage. We're going to talk about what's happening with interest rates. First of all, Greg, talk to me about what happened in April. Where was the market and where is it going in May? We talked a lot about in April comparing year over year uh, the number of contracts that are happening and it was off significantly for our area about 30 percent. Uh, I attribute that to the fact that last April was, a, was the last 30 days before the tax credit expired and it caused uh, people to hurry up and get their home sold. Last May sales declined. This May, so if last April or this April were 30 percent percent off over last April. This year we're already 45, 46 percent up trending for the number of contracts. So I think it's all going to even out when we look at it. We are just moving stuff around and uh, we're going to start to be able to make some sense of the numbers as we get further and further away from that. I think credit. that's the most important thing that, that we'll take away from our program this weekend is that the May numbers are bouncing back up again. Mike, thanks for being on the show. Mortgage rates, where are they right now? Well, Jeff, mortgage rates are once again hitting historic lows. We're seeing the mid 4%. Um, national average was about 4.61. You can even see rates around 45 at times. It's a great, great time to look into buying a house and getting a long-term fin uh, finance property. So uh, we're always telling that our buyer clients to get pre-approved before they head out and search for potentially buying a new home. Does your company handle a pre-approval process as well? Absolutely, Jeff. Our motto at New American and our, our business model is to have your loan completely underwritten up front so your pre-approval actually means something. We will have you cleared to close. This is including appraisal and title work. Once you sign your contract within seven business days, nobody else can touch that. In the That's market. amazing customer service. Have you had a chance to use New American Mortgage? Absolutely. My career has been fortunate to put me in a lot of transactions. I've worked with a lot of lenders and a lot of people trying to get financing straight. I'm a big fan of the New American process. They're, they're getting all the heavy lifting done up front and getting decisions made so people can know they're qualified and then confidently go out in the market and, and seek out that property instead of having the... Uh, the process that yields nothing but frustration later and later in the game, which makes both parties uncomfortable, quite honestly. Well, check us out this weekend, 107.5 FM, every Sunday at 11.30 a.m., or live stream on WCHV.com. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you this weekend, charlottesvilleinsights.com. Thanks. Thanks.